It is Thursday, June 9th, and welcome to a week in my life. Now, this week is going to be fun. That's a lie. I have no plans this week. I have an interview today, and then that's the only plan I have. <laughs> I'm recording a podcast this weekend, so that's going to be good. Hopefully by tomorrow, Matt and I can sleep in the same bed. But our tests that we order, like the COVID tests that you can get, USPS, the free COVID tests you can get, they're not getting here till Monday. So we might wait until Monday so that we can both test and make sure we're both still negative. Or that he's now negative and I'm still negative. Let me show you something that's really annoying to me. Up here on the outside of the building is this little piece of tape that's just flying in our window. And it's so annoying. I keep thinking like it's a bird or a bug or something and it scares me at times. But it's not. It's just a piece of tape. And it like the balcony doesn't go by the living room window. We would have to get like a long tweezers or something. <laughs> I'm making some oatmeal because I want to eat to make sure I'm not super not feeling good by the time the interview gets here. Let's have today be a good day. Let's calm the nerves. As soon as the interview is over, I feel like I'll be okay. Going into the interview makes me really nervous. Okay, Matthew is gone, he just left. I need to open the blinds, Matt's terrible. He hasn't made the bed once. So I wanna show you what I'm wearing real quick. <laughs> wow, my mirror is dusty. All right, so I'm wearing a state-of-the-art N95 mask. And I only have makeup done from here up. <laughs> Straighten my hair, the earrings, the necklace I always wear. Look at this bed. <sighs> I got the shirt on and these pants and these shoes. So, professional. I'm so fucking nervous. I don't like this at all. I don't know what to do. Maybe I'll put on a video for like half an hour and then... <sighs> I don't know. I don't know, you guys. I'm so nervous. There you go. <laughs> all right. It's 1.40. I am going to head to <laughs> the interview. I'm so nervous. <sighs> Let's go. And just like that, the interview is done. I'd say it went well, but I've said interviews have gone well in the past and then I don't get the job. So, fingers crossed, went well. It was an hour. I sat and talked to them for an hour that we can have good news by next week is when they're gonna make the decision. I'm not getting my hopes up. I just got off the phone with Matt and he's like, I'm glad it went well, I'm glad you're feeling good. Like, we're, we're all good asked me like all about it. I told him all about it. Okay. It's done. The interview is fucking done. In a week, I might have a full-time job. <laughs> I'm gonna go home. I need to edit a video. I need to throw podcasting stuff in audition. I want to take a nap. I want to call someone. I don't know who, but just someone. Hey, I got a good parking spot this time. Let's change out of these clothes and get comfy. Maybe I'll go cry. <laughs> Maybe I'll do that. <laughs> I've been laying in bed since I got home. <laughs> Anxiety has killed me and my period's giving me a temperature. <sighs> uh, uh, I need to eat something so I can take Advil. Let's get up and be an adult, because who knows? I may have to fully be an adult full time soon. I'll be working more than 40 hours a week, because it'll be 40 hours a week at a job, five hours a week on a podcast, three hours a week on editing videos, and two days of watching a baby. Okay, so I was looking at what we have, and I still have some Lipton soup, and I have some like Ritz crackers in there. I got these crackers. I think I'm gonna make that, but the only problem is both of the pots are dirty. And I mean, yes, dishes <laughs> will get done, but I don't feel like doing them right this second. So I guess I could just wash one pot. My 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 alternative was to just use a pan to make soup. I'll clean I'll clean one pot. That's not a big issue. I don't have to do all the dishes right now. Cool. <laughs> now I have a pot to make soup in. It's like, <coughs> I don't know what happened to my voice there. It's like 10, just after 10. I don't know what's wrong with my voice. What the heck? It sounds weird. I just spent the last three hours talking to my dad on the phone. So. It's been a couple months since I spoke to him. And so I did. I'm tired of having a temperature. Let's take it together. 
98.7. Let's calm down. I'm gonna go to sleep. I need samples for this job, and I have a couple that are from years ago, and since I don't have anyone to take a picture of right now, I'm taking a picture of East out on the patio. <laughs> it's nice and bright out here. She also wants a video sample, and I'm kind of thinking maybe try to record something to do like a little minute, 30 second to a minute video of like Easton to show that I can cut, edit, I can add some graphics in there. That's what I'm doing right now. I was also writing on the in my journal on the patio for a second, and <laughs> some guy <laughs> drove by hit on me and then drove away, came back, asked for my number. And I was like, I'm married. And he's like, ah, oh, well, you gotta try. It's very weird. I still got it though. Almost 30, but I still got it from four stories up. <laughs> I've just been shooting a lot of video and a lot of pictures who try to submit something to show that I am capable. poured a glass of wine for the video, and now I feel like I have to drink it. <laughs> I got this guy set up to cut some video, or to cut some video, oh my god, to cut some stuff. So, this is what we're looking like. This, and then I'm gonna go stand up there and cut some veggies. Do a little bit at a time so I can do like different angles and fun things, so yeah. Okay, so I edited a video for it. I don't think it's great. Here it is. It's okay. Uh, I'm not happy with it, but I'll try to deal with it. I got the COVID test, so I'm gonna go in the bathroom and take this. I haven't been feeling too great today. I don't know what's going on. Kind of nervous that it's my teeth, but also kind of nervous that it's COVID. It's a little different. I got a little bit lazier by not putting the solution in the thing. When Matt tested positive, it immediately showed it as positive. So I think if I am positive, I'm already feeling sick, it should immediately show negative which makes me feel a little bit better about having a temperature but i've still been having a temperature almost every day for several days i'm gonna take a shower at some points i've had a temperature of 100 and it's just consistently been in the 99s i'm not really sure might have an infection <laughs> who knows let me just lay down maybe i'm just stressed I just converted Matt's video, which is a pre-existing one that the current social media person did, and put it into like a TikTok Reels situation type thing. So that's cool. Okay, finally made it to bed two o'clock in the morning. Matt got home kind of late, like 2 th 12.30. It's gonna sound really bad. After I showed him all of like the stuff that I did for a job that I've applied to, then he was like, you know, I'm not really hungry for dinner. What have you eaten today? I haven't eaten anything today. I had nothing. I had a smoothie for breakfast. That was it. I had coffee, a liquid IV, and I had a smoothie. No wonder I feel like shit. I mean, I don't think that has to do with the temperature, but me just not feeling good in general has to be because I haven't eaten a thing today. So he made me a hot pocket and I ate most of it. I took some ibuprofen. 
I have some crackers in here in case I get hungry. Look at this little table. There's so much crap. Uh, I had so many plans today. So many things I wanted to do, but instead I did stuff to try to get a job, which is good. I enjoy taking pictures. I really liked taking pictures. I really liked editing the videos. I had a lot of fun doing that stuff. So it would be pretty cool to get this job, but if I don't, then I don't and it's okay, but it'd be cool. Anyways, tomorrow is gonna hopefully be productive. I wanna edit a video. Matt and I are gonna try to wake up early-ish, like 10, 30, 11, so that we can have coffee and watch the last episode of The Last Kingdom. Not the last episode, episode four, which is the last one for the podcast. And we're recording the podcast tomorrow, but I also have a podcast meeting with Jasmine and then I have a podcast meeting with Derek after we record a podcast. Yeah, there's a lot that I wanna do tomorrow. So I'm gonna go to sleep. I will see you guys in the morning. Hopefully I feel better. My COVID test is negative, so it's not COVID that's making me feel like this. Hopefully I'm not like false negatives. Matt took a test when he got home, still positive, but like the faintest line of positivity. That's why I'm still in here. When he tests negative for COVID, then I'll wash the bed sheets and we will sleep in bed together. <laughs> it might not be until next week though. And to be completely honest, like I love Matt so much. It's been nice. Having my own room? At first it sucked because he was sick. But now that he's not sick anymore and it's just like, I'm sleeping in here because he's still contagious, but he's totally fine. I mean, a whole bed to myself. Not really to myself because Easton likes to be in here. But anyways, I'm rambling. I'm gonna go to sleep. I'll see you guys in the morning. I'm about to have a meeting with Jasmine. And I still have yet to get dressed. I guess I should get some clothes on, it's two o'clock. Imagine getting this job and me having to get dressed like every day. That'd be weird. I don't know why I'm going in the kitchen to look for clothes. I do have this shirt from yesterday that I didn't wear very long. Oh, off of like two bites of it. Like that's what she likes to do. Yeah. <laughs> Edamame as our appetizer. Yeah. And then shortly after our noodles came to the table. So like all the- Ooh, had my meeting with Jasmine about our podcast. I have all my podcast notes ready. Now I'm gonna watch some YouTube, eat lunch, I'm already doing better than I did yesterday because I had breakfast. <laughs> and I'm having lunch! Yay! Then I'm gonna edit a video, it should take me a couple hours, and then I'm gonna start on the podcast. Maybe I won't start on the podcast because I do have to record a podcast and then have a podcast meeting, so... I don't know. But right now, I'm gonna have some cheese on some crackers. Mm. I did not edit a video, but I caught up on some Michelle Reed ones, which... Caught up. <laughs> I've only watched the last three ones. <sighs> Time to take Buddy out because I need to record a podcast soon and I need to set up. And I think I might set up differently. I've been set up on the ground, like in the bedroom, uh, in our bedroom, in the master bedroom, the last several times. And that's where I'm planning on doing it again. But I also might try somewhere else. God, I look like shit. Why do I look so bad? Yeah, well, yeah I'm fine. Whatever. Okay, well we're outside and Easton was being silly and then he sat down. So I sat down with him and he's so happy. Getting ready to record the episode. We're trying to figure out the next episode before we start recording so that we can then put it in the show notes. I don't feel good. I do have a bubbly. Try to help my tummy. I don't know what's wrong with me. I, what's up? Okay, podcast is done recording. It took so long. It's gonna be a bitch to edit that one. You need to be better about staying on time. I don't feel good though. <laughs> My stomach's hurting, so I'm gonna have cheese and crackers. Probably not the best decision. Animals. <laughs> You're so annoying. Oh, I wonder if the new Kardashian episode is out. I can watch that. I need to start watching the Obi-Wan Kenobi though. And I need to edit a video. Easton, stop hunching over, lay down. Hey, you're so obnoxious. Mwah. Hi, honey. He was so cute when I took him out earlier. Yay, Kardashian. Okay, I'm gonna watch Kardashian. I need some cheese and crackers. Where is she? There she is. I love that she sits on the back of the couch. It's so cute and so cat-like. <laughs> What did I film last night? What did I record? I really don't remember. I know I can look, but I think it's more fun this way. <laughs> this memory just isn't, isn't it right now. What I remember from last night is I felt like shit. I did not feel good at all. I resulted in me just going to bed. And the thing is like, you can tell Matt did the grocery list and he did the food menu for the week because it's stuff that I don't know how to do. It's not that I don't know how to do it, it's that I just don't want to do it. 
and especially if I'm not feeling good. But I thought it was funny because he was like, oh, you can make the stuffed mushrooms. Those will be really easy to make. And I was like, oh, can I make the stuffed mushrooms? Just send me the recipe. And he sent me the recipe. First day I didn't make it because I didn't feel good. I was very anxious. Second day I didn't make it because he was like, oh, it calls for like 20 cremini mushrooms, but just convert it to two portobello tops. 20 mushrooms to two portobellas. Okay, Matt. Okay. And then yesterday I actually looked at the, the recipe and the ingredients and I was like, do we have roasted red peppers? And he goes, no, we don't have a lot of this stuff on there. Just wing it. Just wing it? No, I am not a chef. I am not comfortable in the kitchen right now to wing something I didn't conceptualize as a meal. <laughs> I didn't decide to have stuffed mushrooms. I didn't shop for stuffed mushrooms. I haven't done anything. And then he asked me what I ate yesterday and I was like, well, I had oatmeal for breakfast and then I just had a bunch of cheese and crackers. Like I had cheese and crackers for lunch and I had more cheese and crackers for dinner. And he was like, why? And I go, you didn't buy me anything for lunches when you went grocery shopping. Like I get you're not here for lunches, but I am. And he goes, we have sandwich stuff. Let me tell you what sandwich stuff we have, everybody. We have bread, ham or roast beef that Matt didn't like. We don't have cheese anymore. We have mayo and mustard. So I'd have a mayo, mustard and ham sandwich. So yeah, that did not sound appetizing to me at all. I thought it was funny. I am making oatmeal. That made some beef raviolis last night. There's Parmesan cheese all over the counter from him just grating it haphazardly. Let's go eat this and drink some coffee and wake up. Okay, well, my friend just asked me if I want to go over to her house during nap time. The friend who I nanny for. Before I go, just to be safe, I'm gonna take a COVID test. Matt tested the very slightest, smallest, like you could have, you had a squint to see the line. I'm going to take this test. Let's time lapse this because this is gonna take a minute. Okay, I got the test right here. I got the timer on. Immediately looks okay. I'll let you know in 15 minutes. <laughs> Okay, okay, I have not looked. She's completely negative. <laughs> I'm not going over there till one. It's 12, 25 right now. So I got like 20 minutes till I'm gonna head out. Phoebe's over here just attacking her tail. Oh, it's your problem, baby, it's your tail. Okay, yay, we're in the car, we're getting out of the house. This wasn't the plan to go hang out with her. But when she asked me, at first my answer to any socialization is, in my head at least, is gonna be no. And then I, I looked at the text and I was like, yeah, I need to get out of the house. My anxiety has been killing me for days. I haven't felt good. I feel fine right now, which is great. <laughs> so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go hang out with my, my best friend. It's hot as a motherfucker out here right now. I'm gonna go play board games. I might not sticking to this, but I might try to record a little bit while I'm there. Okay, peace out. I just saw the game. She gave me a little tomato sound. It was so cute. We're playing. Thanks, babe. I made it home. I'm so hungry. I'm gonna go and get some food. That's home. He showered and he made bolognese. <laughs> it was supposed to take two to three hours and I was like no and so we found another recipe that took one hour but then the turkey was still frozen so it added like half an hour I'm starving I had more cheese and crackers and I have a beer <gasps> we're gonna watch a lot of the last kingdom tonight I know I should edit a video but tomorrow cleaning editing posting and maybe grocery shopping yay oh.